Hey, it's Rahani. Today, I'm going to share some of the most interesting use cases of blockchain. Before we get into the use cases, let's do a quick recap of what blockchain is. The blockchain is a permissionless system that has radically challenged the status quo by using cryptography to create a decentralized database. Miners verify transactions on the blockchain. To protect against cheating the system, the blockchain stores information across a network of computers or nodes. The peer-to-peer -peer network makes it extremely difficult for any one person to try and corrupt the blockchain. The digital ledger uses cryptography to ensure that no block can be changed. Each block containing data has its own hash. This is a digital fingerprint that allows anyone to identify a specific block and its contents. This hash is always unique. For example, the Bitcoin blockchain uses SHA-256, which is a set of cryptographic hash functions. In exception of the Genesis block, which is the first block in the chain, each block is coded with its own hash as well as the hash of the block before it. The data inside the hash is dependent upon what type of blockchain is being used. For example, a hash for a block on the Bitcoin blockchain will have details about the transaction. The reason that it becomes difficult to change anything is because changing a block changes its hash. This means that if any one person were to attempt to try and commit fraud, and change a transaction, it causes following blocks to become invalid because they no longer contain the correct hash of their predecessors. This is what makes the blockchain secure, at least one of the things. However, this isn't enough to prevent tampering or fraudulent behavior, so the blockchain uses a multitude of other mechanisms, for example, proof of work or ring signatures, but that's for another video. Now let's get into the use cases. The first use case is the Zero Carbon Project. This project aims to tackle climate change by using the blockchain and international carbon credits. Concerned that the affordability of renewable energy will cause it to take far too long for any change to actually happen, they created a faster acting solution. On the zero carbon market, users can source energy. The carbon emissions that are a result of nuclear energy, fossil fuels, or any other type of energy are compensated for by the international carbon credits. Supporters of the zero carbon platform may earn zero carbon tokens for their help in mitigating climate change. The tokens have utility value because energy suppliers source them in order to pay their fees to participate on the zero carbon market. Moreover, they're competing for business amongst those who are participating in the zero carbon market. The use case two, UHive. This is a social media app designed to spark change and movements. The blockchain-based app works like any other social media and connects friends and family to each other. What's unique is that it also offers a feature called the gray world. This is where users can take on an anonymous or a different identity and talk to anyone. Sounds a little sketchy, doesn't it? To increase privacy and protect users, they created something called the deep web chat room. Here, everyone is anonymous and so is the conversation. What's even more interesting is that efforts to connect with other people are rewarded on the platform. Every week, UHive shares a portion of their ad revenue with the users in the form of UHive tokens. The token's utility is based on the ERC-20 standard, which basically means that it is a ERC-20 token, a token that functions on the Ethereum blockchain. I've actually made one of these, and I've linked the video down in the description to it if you want to check it out. Anyways, this token can be purchased using fiat or even other cryptocurrencies. Use case 3. Nebulous. This is a decentralized cloud storage using blockchain designed to be more secure than traditional cloud storage providers. They created a storage platform called Sia. It has no servers and no third parties. This blockchain-based platform encrypts data using encryption keys for privacy, costs 90% less than traditional cloud servers, and they created a marketplace on which storage providers compete for business and use Sia coin to pay rent. Use case 4. Chronicle, a supply chain management system that is more transparent. They aim to promote trust and efficiency using a blockchain-based network. The company has many solutions including traceability, anti-fraud measure, contract management, and much more. They want to track data in a secure, immutable, and tamper-proof way. Especially combined with IoT and sensors, blockchain can create a great link between a physical product and its digital identity. Use Case 5 
Odin. This blockchain project aims to curb unemployment. They focus on education and skill acquisition. They allow users to have access to affordable and verifiable learning tools. Once users earn credentials like cybersecurity or blockchain development, they can be shared with employers using the decentralized blockchain storage system that they've created. This means employers can easily verify qualifications by simply looking for the academic records. If you take away anything from this video, let it be that this technology is incredibly versatile. The use cases I talked about touched upon climate change, social media, global unemployment, supply chain management, and cloud storage. The common denominator, the blockchain. Till next time.